is Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company, also known as TSMC, making North Phoenix the next tech city, just like in the past, as Intel has done to Chandler and Agutillo. I'm a firm believer that Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company, TSMC, is going to make North Phoenix one of the biggest tech cities here in Phoenix, Arizona, just like Intel did in Chandler, Arizona, and also what it did to Ocotillo, Arizona as well, where they came in and built factories and hired so many employees, created so many jobs for Phoenix, Arizona, and now that has been a tech city in the East Valley in Chandler and Ocotillo, but now we have TSMC creating a $40 billion, that is right, a $40 billion factory in North Phoenix in the desert where nothing has been established, but now I believe North Phoenix is gonna be where you want to move to, live at, play at, because appreciation is gonna go up, home prices are gonna go up, but the lack of inventory just around North Phoenix makes it kind of difficult for you to actually find a home. But I'm gonna show you the lay of the land of TSMC, where it's located, some established subdivisions, and then now you can make a sound decision if you're thinking about moving, investing, or buying near TSMC, then we can actually obviously help you out as I am a real estate investor and realtor in the state of Arizona. My name is Victor Huerta here, a local agent. And if you're thinking about buying, selling, investing in real estate, we definitely can help you out. With that being said, let's go show you exactly where TSMC, the Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company is located. And then we're gonna get into all those details. So let's take you over here to TSMC. Now it is located in North Phoenix, right off the I-17 heading north. So here you are looking at the plant and this is actually um, heading north off of I-17. If I scroll out here, you will see the major freeway I-17 right here. Now this freeway goes all the way up north to Sedona and Flagstaff. And this is the freeway that you'll be taking to head up north. This is the only freeway you can get up and down north and south to the TSMC. And they have built this 303 freeway that wraps around the entire valley of Phoenix, Arizona. You see it comes all the way over here and it'll wrap all the way down to the west side where you can actually get on the I-10 facing going west to California. So this is where TSMC is located and central from central Phoenix. It is quite a drive. You have to take I-17 down into the city of Phoenix, Arizona, uh, right here in the middle, as you can tell. So if you're looking to move close to TSMC, I'm going to show you what's around, what's happening, etc. But this is exactly where it's located, it is located in North Phoenix. And this is a big $40 billion plant that's being built here in North Phoenix. And I think it's gonna be a game changer for the city of Phoenix, Arizona. Now, I wanna show you the lay of the land over here by TSMC in North Phoenix, because you may think that if you're moving here, from Taiwan or you're actually going to relocate from a different city because you're applying for a job here. There's not a whole lot of residential, especially here in Phoenix, Arizona, and there's not a whole lot of residential happening up there in North Phoenix. There's a lot of home builders have actually bought some land to start building, but your wait time is going to be a year to maybe 16 months till that home is actually built. There are a couple spec homes that you can actually purchase but you're just going to have to wait. Now, finding a rental property here also by TSMC is going to be very, very difficult, but you have so many workers here coming here to work. Now, the news is that locals, local workers are being pushed out and they're actually going to be shipping foreign workers from Taiwan to come finish the construction. So now there is a battle between uh, foreign workers and American workers. There's a battle between safety issues here at the Taiwan Semiconductor Plant. This is all inside knowledge here because I was in the tech industry, so I have connections across the board around multiple corporations. And then there's also, now that they're building this $40 billion plant in Phoenix, Arizona, TSMC, the Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company, is requesting $15 billion 
of the CHIP Act to finish processing this plant. And not only that, they have delayed the opening for over a year because they see a rebound happening in a year for the chipsets. So there's a lot of moving parts here, but let's go take a look at the lay of land just in case you're thinking about moving, living in Phoenix, Arizona, relocating to Phoenix, Arizona, or even just coming over for like a seat assignment or a co-op assignment. And you just want to kind of get the figure of the lay of land of where you can live at, where actually how long the drive is and etc. So let's go take a look at that right now. Now I'm going to go back to 2015, actually December of 2015 and show you the lay of the land on actually how it looks like before all this started happening. Now, as you can see here, as we are December of 2015, this is Lake Pleasant right here. Uh, this is a, a part, this is a lake and people go over there skiing, they go boat, they can take their boats out there, they take their ATVs, they go a lot, they do a lot of riding, side by side riding. So there is a lot of stuff happening over here about people who love the outdoors, uh, lake, skiing, tubing, uh, swimming, whatever that may be. So this is December of 2015, as you can see here, is there's really not much where uh, TSMC was at, was, is, was going to be built. You can see it's nothing but desert. And of course you got mountains here. Now look at the subdivisions that are here. These are well-known subdivisions that have been here for quite some time. So Northern Foothills, Copper Leaf, Stone Edge, Amber Hills, uh, Tramonto, Desert Hills. And then you have, I see you have these estates here where these are uh, acre parcels, okay? Acre parcels in Anthem. You can see Anthem was already built as well so anthem was actually a subdivision that was there as well now if you go up to i-17 to new river um there's mobile homes there there's homes but these are one acre parcels as well but you can see here is look at the mountains there's not a whole lot of places to live at in 2015 and what was being built so now if we move the needle all the way forward to 2023 I believe let's see here let me bring it all the way forward so this is 2020 you can see that stuff started being built here we had the new freeway of the 303 and we had the site location of the tsmc which is right here as well now this freeway 303 has been being, being built and there has been a lot of new construction over here by vistancia which is a well-established um subdivision as well but you see a lot of builders are building over here in this side of the west valley so people can get to and from the tsmc plant seeing phoenix arizona and the north phoenix girl especially with tsmc all that west valley where i pointed out to at the 303 freeway is growing like mad okay that's where you're gonna find the new construction there if you're looking to build a house that's kind of where you're going to be at at a price range of say 450 to a million dollars plus they are building homes with rv garages because the lake is right there you have lake pleasant people like to go to flagstaff and sodona so you're gonna be in an area where there's a lot of outdoors people a lot of people are very frustrated that this tsmc plan is coming in because a lot of people love the outdoors this is where they ride their motorcycles their quads their atvs they ride their side-by-sides they haul trailers up and down to Lake Pleasant, their boats. Okay. So while you're moving from a different city or from Taiwan, you have to be patient. You're going to have to learn that not everybody's going to be driving fast, right? We're talking about trucks, pulling camper trailers, RVs, boats, etc. So you're going to have to kind of maneuver around and be patient on these freeways. Now, over here on the West Valley, where I showed you the 303, that's where you're gonna be looking for to buy new construction. For resale, moving in quick, those other subdivisions that I showed you, is that's where you're gonna be, is a Tremonto, right? Sonoran Foothills, uh, Norterra, and then you can actually move to Scottsdale and cut across from the East to the West Valley. But that's the lay of the land of where TSMC's at and what it looks like. If you're coming from out of state, so you can kind of be familiar of what it looks like and where to live and um, what you're actually going to see when you come to Phoenix, Arizona, because some people come to move here and work at TSNC and they're like, man, I thought I was going to find a house like in 
in 90 days it's like that's not the case we have low inventory we still have very very we have low demand okay but it's we, with the inventory that we have we still don't have enough homes here in phoenix arizona and across the u.s we're five million homes short so just think about that with everybody moving in from california uh, portland oregon colorado getting just getting away from the, the cold states and washington and seattle due to some the homeless issues and other issues that's happening over there there's a lot of people just moving here to phoenix arizona especially to this tsmc plant in north phoenix well i hope you enjoyed today's video about the tsmc plant and how it's going to reshape north phoenix and make it into another tech city now once again to recap some notes 40 billion dollar plant 15 billion they're asking for the tax credits for the for the chip act um gave you the lay of the land uh gave you some established subdivisions okay showing you where the new construction is at and also you got to be familiar that they're having some issues with the construction right now being delayed they're bringing in foreign workers and current local workers they're both fighting and they're getting pushed over so that there's a lot of stuff's happening there's a lot of safety issues that are being alerted um so just be aware that when you come down here and you're looking to buy a home or relocate it's not going to be very very easy to find not only a home to move in right away it's going to have to be new construction you're going to have to be resale you might be have to be further away to the city maybe on that 303 loop okay or north uh, glendale um you could do glendale you could do surprise or north phoenix you could do anthem or new river heading a little bit north but you will be away from the city because this is way way up north or you can move to scottsdale and head east to west to get to your location but with that being said all my information is below if you're looking to buy sell invest in some real estate we definitely will love to help you out check out the google reviews and check out my previous videos and we'll see you on the next video